Hi, this is Victor Mulgetti from Vive. Today we're going to be looking at Boston Online, which allows you to do fact-based modelling in the ORM methodology through your browser. What you'll need is a subscription license to Boston Professional, our conceptual modelling tool, and access to Boston Online comes with that subscription. First thing you need to do to get to Boston Online is to go to our website, www.vive.com, go to Products, and click on Boston Cloud Service. The web page that comes up just gives a bit of a spiel about Boston Online and provides in the top left corner a Go to Boston Online button which we'll click and we'll click on Boston. So that's just loading the application now. The first thing it will do is ask for our username and password So we'll just put in our credentials. And here we have Boston Online. I'll just go to full screen mode in the browser and what you'll notice is that Boston Online is actually a Windows application that you're running through your browser. So Boston Online is exactly the same as the Boston desktop product and if you already have a license you'll be very familiar with how Boston works. We've got a model already in our database, our university model, we'll just load that up and we'll load up the page lecturer. So you notice that's fairly quick and just as quick as using the desktop application. The toolbox when you're using it you need to click on an item in the toolbox and just wait a few seconds for it to turn blue and that activates that form. We're working on ways to make that a little bit quicker so we'll just add an entity type and a value type to our page and because we don't want to keep those we'll remove them from the page in the model. So you have exactly the same forms that you'll find in the, in the desktop version of, of Boston so if we click on lecturer we'll see a verbalization in the verbalization toolbox if we go to the reading editor and click on a fact type we'll see a fact type reading. For that fact type lecturer has maximum teaching hours. The virtual analyst is also available in Boston and online and the error list for errors in the model is a few errors in this model. You can also import FBM models directly from your desktop into the cloud. So we'll select a, a model and we'll load that up. So that's transferring that model up into the cloud and we can open that, that model just like using Boston Desktop. Printing is to PDF files which you can download to your desktop. So just select the Thinity Virtual UI printer name and hit OK. Gives you a print preview. When you print, press the print button, uh, you'll be redirected to a PDF file. So we'll just say allow once to allow that through and there's our PDF file. So that's a PDF file showing up in the browser so if we right click on that we can save that to our local desktop as a as a PDF. So we'll just go back to standard browser mode. So that's Boston Online. Uh, exactly the same as the standalone version that you'll run on your desktop. When you finish running the application. We don't want to save any changes to the model that we worked with. 
you'll be re redirected back to the Boston Online Service page and you can click on Vive if you want to, to just go back to the Vive website. That's Boston Online, thank you very much for watching.